Zimbabwe'nin iktidar partisi Zanu PFC'nin önerdiği küresel kalkınma inisiyatifini takdir ettiğini açıkladı ve bunu özellikle gelişmekte olan ülkelere fayda sağlayacak son derece önemli bir deklarasyon olduğunu ifade etti. Simbara Shemun Bengeng ve Zanu PF Politbürosu'nun dış ilişkilerden sorumlu sekreteri ve Zimbabwe'nin eski dışişleri bakanı. Mun Bengeng ve GDI'yi artan küresel zorluklar karşısında küresel birliği teşvik etmeye yardımcı olması beklenen ve tam zamanında yapılan bir deklarasyon olarak övdü. Yes, on the global development initiative as enunciated in September last year, this is an extremely important you know declaration and position you know taken by China. That in the face of all these challenges that we have referred to in the new era, a global approach is required. We have to look at these challenges you know, globally so that uh, the challenges are faced collectively, so that the benefits are shared collectively. Our own president, Comrade Idi Munangago, you know, has said we should aim here in Zimbabwe to develop all parts of the country leaving no place and no person behind. And this is very much uh, along the same lines as on the Global Development Initiative. It has to be done on a global scale. And I have no doubt that we in the developing countries uh, uh, will be the beneficiaries of this declaration. No other country has contributed to the development of the uh, African continent as China has done, in both bilaterally and within the FOCAC framework. You know, and so uh, we very much you know, welcome you know, the initiative uh, that uh, we have to move forward to a shared future, not a selfish future, but one which is shared by all countries of the world, rich or poor. The poor must be assisted. Those you see, who have been able to develop their economies should help those who are less developed so that they too, they come up. So as we move forward, we are extremely confident that our relationship with the Communist Party of China and the government of China is going to deepen to enable us to achieve the targets that we have set for ourselves for the year 2030 on the economic front. The beautiful aspect of China's transformation is that China has not been selfish to enjoy the benefits of the creativity of the Communist Party of China by themselves. They have shared their experiences with all the developing countries. We in ZANU-PF have benefited tremendously from China's willingness to share their experiences with us. We in Zimbabwe, in Zanu PF, in Africa, are extremely grateful you know, for this gesture of solidarity, this gesture of sharing, you know, this gesture of identifying a common interest for all humanity.